Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got an unbagging to do today and there's a little box inside this one as well. And this one has come to me from the lovely people at paintsomeway.com. And um, they asked me if I would like some products to show on my channel. So yes, of course. Thank you very much. I've loved everything that I've had from you in the past and I really do enjoy showing their products. So yay, let's see what we got this time. So that's our box. It's one of those flat boxes with the diamonds on. So I'm thinking, nice little project there. And then we have, oh, a diamond painting. Oh, that's quite heavy. There's quite a few gems in there. And then, oh, 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 sneak peek, sneak peek. Turn it that way around so you can't see it. <laughs> Okay, um, just to quickly let you know, there are lots of special offers still on at Paint Somewhere. Um, over $49 is free shipping. And if you spend over $30, you get a free gift. Yay, we like free gifts. And there is money off at the moment as well. So um, buy one item and you get 8% off. And it goes 10 items, you get 20% off. It's easy to put 10 in your basket, I have to say. Uh, and that'll probably get you to your uh, $49 free shipping as well. If you buy 25 items, you get 23% off. So, wow, if you're wanting to get Christmas presents and things and stocking up, then yeah, really good prices. Uh, if you do want to go and check out the website, go and have a look yourself. Obviously, if you're watching this in a couple of months' time, the offers may have changed. But at the moment, they're the offers that are on as I'm making this video okay let's have a look at this one it's a nice little box oh there's no giveaways on it so there's no little pictures to sell us what it might be let's see let's see kiddo oh what's this one what's this one oh it's our little santa look at that oh how cute is he okay oh and it's a special drill and it's all bagged up ready hey excellent excellent Right, just get rid of that bit of uh, cardboard there. Okay, let's get into this. Where's the opening? Come on, where's the opening? There it is. Oh, oh, it's right down there. <laughs> okay, so this is one of the new little acrylic uh, Christmas decorations. Look at that. Oh, how cute is he? I just couldn't resist it. I love a really smiley, jolly Santa. And he's got a teddy bear as well. So, yeah. Oh, he's lovely. Look, he's got a real smiley face and his little red nose and his little red cheeks as well. He's just going down a chimney pot. Look, he's got one leg in and one leg out, just ready to jump down and take all his sack of presents there. Look. All these lovely wrapped presents. We've got a little Christmas tree there. And that gorgeous teddy. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, he's got his little gloves on as well. Yay! Let's hope the chimney's clean, otherwise he won't come out looking that clean, will he? <laughs> and we've got his little stand as well. These do have um, like a dust cover on each side. So they just need peeling off. Looks like we've got a little bit of paper stuck on that one, but that's okay. That'll come off. Uh, just grab your tweezers. If you can't get your uh, little cover sheet off, just get your tweezers and just get underneath. And uh, you might find that it's just a little bit easier to peel. And they put one on both sides. It's like a dust and scratch cover. So a little bit like your cover sheets on your diamond painting. Just keeps it nice and clear. And I do like the clear ones. Because then it looks as though they're just sort of like stood and they're not stood on anything when they're on your mantelpiece or your shelf. So let's have a look at him. I love the brickwork on this as well, all the different uh, bits of brick in between. So yeah, he will then just stand in. Oh, the back, the back of this as well has uh, a cover sheet on it. Uh, I've just put my tweezers away, so I won't get it. I won't uh, ruin my nails doing it, but yeah. Um, it has got a cover on as well. So once this is done, all the edges will be completely clear. And uh, then he will just stand in his little stand. Oops. Oh, <laughs> I'm thinking, why is it not going in? Yeah, the little bit of plastic on the stand look has just got left in. But uh, its own pops out. And then Santa will just pop in. Like he does going down the chimney. <laughs> So that's your little Santa, yeah. You sometimes find that uh, with key rings and acrylic things when the layers are cut, um, that you do get an odd little piece left in. They're easily just bulked out and you could always use it if you wanted it for something, but just throw it away. 
Okay. All right, we have our standard pen, bought and wax as normal. Though. And then, I can't believe this, it's not very often you get this special drill projects in little grip seal bags. That's really, really good. So this one's kitted up already for you, just to sit down and get diamond painting. So you don't even need a pair of scissors with this kit. You can just get your pen, boat and wax, fill your pen up with your wax, put your gems in your boat and off you go. So, wow, so we have a lovely a clear crystal and a little bit of a blue, Ooh, that's lovely, that's an ice blue crystal and a very pale lemon crystal and a nice yellowy gold and a little bit richer yellowy gold Ooh, with a hot pink in there, look. There's a hot pink gem escaped and said, I'm going to Lizzie's house. <laughs> and that one's like a honey gold colour. And then we have, gosh, there's all sorts of different colours in this one. Is this the right gems for this? Oh, it'll be for what's in his sack, won't it? His parcels there. So, yeah, we've got a little bit of like a grapey colour. And we have a hot pink. Yay, hot pink. And a lovely Christmassy green. That'll be his gloves. And a gorgeous red. That'll be for uh, all his little jacket and his drowsies and his hat. And then more of a, a muted gold there. And a little bit of a bronzy colour. You're a standard 310 black colour. And another little bit of a purpley colour. Ooh. So we have, what, where do we go up to? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 different colours. That is a lot of colours on a little project. Wonderful. But I love the fact that it's all bagged up as well. That's great. Loving it. Okay, so that's our gorgeous little Santa. Shall we give him a quick measure? It wouldn't be a Liz video if we didn't produce the tape measure at least once. <laughs> Sorry about the shadows. It is a little bit dark today. So it is raining today. Whoopie doo. Right, so we're 20 centimetres, uh, which is eight-ish eight -ish inches. And my measurements aren't to the exact millimetre. And we're about 12 to 13 centimetres, about five inches across. And your little stand, just to give you its footprint, is uh, 10 centimetres, four inches by six centimetres, a two and a half inches. So, yeah, but don't you think he's just a really jolly, lovely face on that Santa? I do like these. Yeah, if you're going to have a Santa, you've got to have a nice happy one, haven't you? <laughs> Okay, so that's our little project number one. And then this one is a little bit of fun. Uh, oh, the Santa was $6.99 on the website. He is still there at the moment. And this painting is a special drill. And it is a $4.99 on the website at the moment. Okay. So this, uh, yeah, uh, one of my uh, lovely YouTubing friends well friends that i've met through youtube and um, but i have actually met as well uh, was saying that uh, she she's not really keen on christmas which i know there's a lot of people and um, either don't celebrate break christmas or don't like christmas because you know, things have happened or they just generally don't like it and um, i love it so i do apologize and um, i tend to go overboard my house will look like santa's grotto by christmas uh, and I do start decorating early, so but I do appreciate that other people aren't very um, keen on it. And uh, that friend's hubby did actually say to her, I'm going to get you something with the Grinch on because she's not very keen on Christmas. So I thought, well, this might just be something that I could get and do and send to her. <laughs> just as a little joke. And uh, yeah, I know she'd find it funny. So, yeah, obviously don't do that to people that wouldn't find it funny, but I just thought that was, yeah, join in with her hubby and just say ho, ho, ho to her. <laughs> and I think it's a lovely Christmas picture as well. Um, yeah, obviously it's got the Grinch on it, so, yeah. Do you know, I've not actually seen that film. I've seen bits of it, but I've never seen the whole film all the way through, so maybe this Christmas I will actually sit and watch it. And, yeah. I do like, I'm not, I don't know whether it's intentional. Um, I know the ho ho ho's, the H in the ho ho ho's um, are supposed to be close, but they do look like sort of like dungarees, don't they? These look like the leggings and these look like the top part of a dungaree. Maybe it's just uh, my imagination. 
Um, but yeah, that's what they look like to me. And then obviously your little ho ho hoes, your oars. I've got uh, little Santa hats on. That one's just got a little bit of a decoration on it because it's too close to the edge. <laughs> And then, uh, yeah, a lovely big character there. So there is quite actually quite a few gems on this. There is quite a lot of coverage on this. And um, the background, there's nothing on the background. It is just a plain white background. But then, uh, yeah, everything else has got quite a few gems on it. So there is quite a few to put on it. So 30 by 30. We have 10 different gems on it. And these two at the bottom here look like they're going to be a special drill. Uh, special shape sorry so and they have got the numbers on them and as you know as i'm kitting down now i am trying to match up numbers with numbers so we have standard pen butt and wax and look at all these crystals 10 different what oh look at all those grains right let's give it a quick measure let's see it'll probably be about a 25 by 25 but we will have a look so yeah, 25, nine and three quarter, uh, 25 centimetres, nine and three quarter inches. By 25 centimetres, nine and three quarter inches. I'll just about to say that in my sleep. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Right, so let's have a look at the crystals. Okay, oh, they're lovely and clear. Look how sparkly these are. Wow, I love it when they come and they're really, really clear and sparkly. So we have our silver, our Christmassy red, our Christmassy green, and then the standard black, which looks like it's going to be edging um, a lot of the Grinch and uh, the belts and everything on here. Then we have this, this pale green and a very, very dark green. And look at that colour. That's a real jade green colour. Wow, like that one. And then a little bit of gold. And then our two specials are some large black. They're like a semi-sphere. They've got no facets on. And then some iridescent coated large pearls there. Wow. So are they for the hats? Oh, do we only need one? We only need one of those. And we've got three. Thank you. We like spares. And it looks like number nine. We only need two. And we've got a whole pack full. Yay! So I'll definitely be kitting these down. Excellent. <laughs> right. So that is our lovely special drill Grinch canvas. And then if we just move that one out of the way. I'll move this one as well. We have a square diamond painting. So let us have a look at this one. This one was also $6.99. And we have, oh look, it's a lovely smiley snowman. And he's in like a wreath. It isn't a wreath, um, but it's sort of wreath. So let's give him a bit of a flatten. Okay, now let me just give you a bit of a squidge. Okay, it's got a little bit creased in the post, but that's okay. It's poured glue, so it will flatten out lovely, just under something heavy. It's a very, very soft canvas. Mm. Just a bit squidge at this side as well. A very big piece of cover sheet as well on it. Right, get all the bubbles out, get all the creases. Just helps it lay that little bit flatter. Uh, but keep it under something heavy, a book or something like that, or in your, one of your folders if you've got them, um, or in my case, underneath all my other diamond paintings, because there's so many it will weigh it down. <laughs> then, uh, yeah, it will just flatten it out. We have a 30 different colours. Looks like we're all symbols and letters, reasonably clear. Uh, we've got DMC codes and it's also giving us the quantity of all the drills down here as well. Um, R, which looks like that's the background colour, is 3865 and there is 3865 of those. That's the biggest colour. Uh, the darker colour here does look very dark, but if you use your light pad, or in my case I use... Um, I've got a magnifying light that I use, then they, they will show up, but they're, they're not blurred at all. 
um, I think you can see, yeah, it's focusing in. It's not blurred, it is just very dark. So you may need a light pad or whatever. Depends on how good your eyesight is. Um, I have terrible eyesight, so I tend to need that little bit of help. Okay, and then we have all of our drills. Oh, and we have ABs. It is an AB one. Wow, look at those. Okay, they're all backed up ready, which is excellent. So out of the three projects, I've got two of them I could just sit and do now uh, without even using a pair of scissors. So that's marvellous. You know, if you're wanting to take them on holiday or whatever, you know, it's already uh, bagged up for you. Wonderful. Have a look at those in a second. Um, your little tool kit. When it's a square, you do usually tend to get a pair of tweezers in with square paintings. So we've got our little, they're not the best tweezers, but if you've not got any, then they're good enough um, to use. I tend not to use tweezers for diamond painting, but some people do. Do you know there's no pen in this, is there? <laughs> Oh dear, we've got a, an enormous piece of wax and um, we've got, I think that will be, that's a ten placer. So we've got a ten placer, a little boat uh, with the ridges in and it's got a little spout. So they're always good for pouring back into your bottles. And uh, yeah, there's no pen in this one. So here's me saying, oh, you could just get on and do this one. And there's no diamond painting pen in it. But I'm sure you've got plenty of pens and, uh, yeah, it's not particularly uh, bothersome to me that there's no pen in it. But I just think that's quite funny. <laughs> this is a Friday afternoon one. They've forgotten to put the pen in. <laughs> oh, dear. Right, just pop those back in there. So that's your little toolkit. Do you know, when I picked it up, I thought, oh, this seems a bit different. <laughs> okay, right. So I won't be uh, writing and saying my pen was missing because, as I say, I've got hundreds. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's really funny. All right, let's have a look at these drills. So 30 different ones. Okay, and we'll have a look at the ABs as well. The price of this was $6.99. So a square drill canvas. Uh, it says it's 30 by 30. I think it's probably a true 30 by 30. Uh, and it looks like we've got a lot of ABs in this one as well. So we are, yep, it's a true 30 by 30, which is 12 inches. So 30 centimetres, 12 inches. So it's a full size. That's your background. Uh, to be honest, oh, come on, get off there. Don't want to tear this bag. Ooh, come on, that's it. Wow, don't want to be tearing bags with drills in. You know what I'm like and spilling. <laughs> All right, so that's three, uh, three eight six five. That's your background. There's a lot there. It doesn't look like there is that much background, but obviously there is. I suppose there's a little bit here. So okay, so that's number twenty nine. And wow, look at these. So let's do these as well. We've got all these different ABs. We've had a few with ABs in recently. I love the fact that they're starting to do the square cam. Um, the square ab canvases it's great so number one just put these in order and we'll double check we've got all the drills make sure they're all here that's number 20 oh that's another ab that's number 22 so we'll keep those separate that's number 11 number eight look at all these gorgeous colors 14 and five, that's one of the lower numbers, that's one of the twenties. <gasps> oh look, there's loads of ABs in this, goodness me. So we've got number 13 there, 313. Oops, number 10, look at the orange, his nose is going to be ABs, wow. And his scarf, that's going to have, AB is Aurora Borealis, it's like a coating that they put on the gem, an iridescent coating. So you get like that oil on water effect. Um, just in case you're new to diamond painting. I know sometimes uh, I forget that people maybe haven't uh, done any diamond painting yet and think, what on earth are you talking about? If I do do that, then please pop a comment down below and just say, oi Liz, what are you on about? <laughs> and I'll try and answer your questions. Right, that's number 30, top of the shop. 24, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 different... Uh, AB crystals, wow, number nine, number 28, 
it's a good way of doing this and actually checking you've got all your drills as well. You don't want to get started and then find you've got one missing. Ooh, peppermint cream green. A little bit of aqua. A little bit of purple. And number six and number 17 so let's have a look we've got three and four there so we start off one two three four five six seven oh where's number eight okay we've got number eight missing so let's just uh no we definitely I'll maybe put it in one of these piles Okay, and then number nine, right, and then number ten. So we're number eight missing, so remember that. Remind me just in case. There's definitely nothing else in the bag. And we'll just pop those away. Okay, I'll just keep them together. I'm going to write that down, actually, because I know what I'm like. <laughs> so I'm looking for number eight. Okay, give me a shout if you see it. Right, so then we want, so we've got 10, so we're looking for number 11. Oh, there's number eight. Look, we're not missing number eight, it's there. It's, uh, silly me, no good at counting, so we'll put that in there. So, so it's unusual if there's one missing. It's a long, long, long time since I've had any drills missing, I must admit. So 11, uh, 12, 13. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Oh, all these lovely colours. They look like nice squares as well. But as with everything, you do need to do with the canvas to make sure that the squares are okay and that they fit okay. And then we have 21. Twenty-two. I'm thinking I've got one missing. No, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. That huge bag and thirty. So we've got all of our drills. So that's excellent. All tipped, tipped off. Yay! Okay, so let's have a look where some of these A B's go. Wow, these are wonderful. I love that colour. Uh, that one is definitely number 10. Is a five. Yeah, that's going to be all around his nose look. Yay. Oh, and a little bit on his scarf as well. So they're all spattered about a bit. So number three. Where's number three? Is an H. Oh, and that's going to be his hat. H for hat. Oh, wonderful. Okay. Oh, it's all of his hat. Wow. Oh, that's going to look good. That's going to be really sparkly. So that's the black but it's got the like um, greeny AB coating on it. Wow. Okay. Uh, number four is, sorry, you'll have to bear with me. I should have brought a magnifying glass up. Uh, number four is like the four little dots. So come here, little dots, where are you? Little dots, little dots. Can anybody see the four little dots? <laughs> it's a light colour, it's a grey colour. It's going to be in the shading somewhere. Is it on the scarf? No. Oh, it's round here, look. It's there. I'm thinking I can't see this at all, but it is. It's sort of like in the shading round here. We've just got a little bit of shading round uh, the snowman's face. And then there's, oh, right, there's a few here as well. Do you know, once you finally find one, you start seeing them all. And I've been looking at this for five minutes looking for them. <laughs> all right, okay, number seven is a K. Okay. And that's going to be, oh, his scarf. So his scarf and his hat are going to be very, very sparkly. Lovely. Uh, number 10, I think we've already looked at, yeah, well, it's number five, which is his a uh, little nose and his little bit of scarf there. Just put these this way up so that I know I've looked at them. Number 12 is number 7. Oh, I hate it when they're like this because I know I'm going to be muddling up putting number 7 on number 12 and number 12 on number 7. Oh, that's going to be all around the bottom here. 
so we've got a little bit of shading and a little bit of smack sparkle mixing words up again sparkle down at the bottom of the snowman uh, number 13 is this lovely peppermint cream green color and that is a little side arrow so i think that's probably going to be on the snowman as well is it a little side arrow. yeah this is shading around the snowman's face wow so it's going to be like this um moonlight sparkling onto the snowman and the snow's glistening in the moonlight oh can you just imagine you'll be able to see your breath in the snow and you'll be walking along and it'll be crisp and quiet and there'll just be all sparkle on the snowman oh after all this hot summer we've had it'll be lovely if we just got a bit of snow right and um, b is all around here so oh right so the hat's all done and then all around the hats wow goodness me so that's like the inner part of the it is like a wreath because it's like a circle or like a plate isn't it that is on and number 21 is j so oh and that's going to be the outer of the uh, circle of the plate so wow very sparkly and finally number 22 is the side and then that's sort of around the bottom here and have we got any on the face here no it looks like it's just sort of around the bottom there's only a very very bit small bit of that little like pale green so that's wonderful but six dollars 99 for a 30 by 30 with 30 colors and nine ab's that's brilliant really really good price wonderful right so let's get him put away so we've had our lovely snowman with all his ABs, nine ABs on a 30 by 30. Wow. We've had our little ho 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 Grinch. Yay. Not for everybody, but uh, yeah, just in case you're not keen on Christmas and all his lovely sparkly drills. And then our little Santa coming down your chimney. And uh, yeah, he's just saying to uh, the Grinch over there. And that one's all bagged up, ready to go. Okay, well, a huge thank you, Paint Some Way, for sending me these. I love them. They're absolutely marvellous. Um, yeah, I can't wait to get on with them. I say, I, I do apologise, but I absolutely love Christmas. Uh, it's my favourite time of year. In fact, actually, I think the run-up to Christmas and doing all the decorations and getting excited about it, uh, I like better than actual Christmas Day. <laughs> yeah, I'm that person. Okay, well, as I say, another huge thank you, Paint Somewhere, for sending these. They're brilliant. Uh, if you've enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a thumbs up is very much appreciated. Any comments or questions in the comments down below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And if you want to join our little family and come back and see what we get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner and the all notifications bell that pops up, you'll be notified when all of my videos come up and you're not going to miss anything. Yay! Okay, thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.